Boslett fires the early three, and it's good. And good start for the Lady Lions here on a Saturday afternoon. We're coming from you live from the Adler Gymnasium. And a half into the ball game. There's a steal by Grip going back the other way in transition. Right hand good. Boslett finds Zimmerman outside. Alexis Stitt a three. She drills it. Some hot shooting to start in this one. Great ball movement there by the Lady Lions to create the open three. That So far against the zone, the uh, Lady Lions have had some, some excellent ball movement and uh, they've knocked down a couple open looks so far. A couple of the last few games. Well, a nice feed there on the inbounds to Megan Wheeler and she hits the little baby jumper. As Grip looks to push the other way for the Lady Lions, she gets inside. Nice little move and a right hand off the window. As her shot ripped away. Wheeler now a pull up from the foul line, and it's good. Definitely one of the better starts uh, Penn State Altoona has gotten off to in recent games. Boslett slows things down and sets up the offense. DeSanto back to Boslett. Wheeler high post, good ball movement by the Lady Lions. It's a DeSanto long two. A wide open three from Stitt and she knocks it down. DeSanto. Good ball movement, working the shot clock, a pull up jumper. Off the mark by Wheeler. She gets it right back up again with it and gets the roll to fall. Good patience working against this 2-3 zone shown by the Lady Lions. Boslett open for three, a little short, didn't hit anything, but there's Shannon Zimmerman cleaning it up. Zimmerman, much like Jordan Smith from the men's basketball team, really succeeds at those tough inside gritty points. Grip, a little hesitation move to the rim. Boslett passes on it. Here's a pull up three. Grip, no doubt about it. Shoot the J. Moved by Corona. Getting inside and finishing. By Corona. Nice little fake by Zimmerman as she goes the distance with the left hand. Boy, she got the ball on the uh, far sideline there at midcourt and saw that uh, nobody was home defensively. We've got to maintain our intensity level. We can't drop in any way, or else the Eagles are a strong enough team. They'll creep back in. Plus, the lines pull it out. Boslett in open three now. Rims out. Wheeler inside and in one. And did the Lady Lions need that or what? Well, I tell you what, that uh, couldn't have come at a better time. Uh, rebound off the missed foul shot for Megan Wheeler. Dangerous cross court pass does get to Stitt, and she dribbles it across. Boslett makes the extra pass to DeSanto, who fakes a pass and drills the three. Boy, such a vital turn of events here in the last minute. Lady Lions, were, uh, their lead was cut to four with a minute two to go in the quarter. A foul shot, a put back by Wheeler, and a three from DeSanto. Allowing the Lady Lions to get that lead back to 10 heading into the fourth quarter. DeSanto, some, some way finds Wheeler. Not a lot of real estate underneath the hoop there, but she was able to tiptoe along the baseline and find a trailing Wheeler. Stays strong with it and gets it out as the Lady Lions work their offense. It's Grip getting inside and finishing with the right hand. Uh, what a spark Grip's been today. 13 points now on the day, and uh, she's been the difference today, both in the first half getting out that large lead and then Stretching the six-point lead back out to eight. Lions with it now, looking to extend their lead. Grip a three. Big time three by Nicole Grip to double their lead and make it six for this final five. 55-54, four and a half to play. A nice cross-court pass. Grip with the right hand, good. Can't say enough about Nicole Grip's effort. Worth. McGee, she's been big from three so far. No good on this one. Shot clock is dead. They got a foul, but it's grip up ahead and all alone. Right hand good. No good on the little floater. As that ends the ball game. 
Final score, Lady Lions 65, Lady Spartans 58. A nice job by the Lady Lions in this one to hold on and pull out a victory here at home.